I come up with the song really strongly first. Like I've come in with, the, with my music, with my song, which has the folk song elements in it. But then it's very open, what happens then? The folk songs are like have become a great platform for writing music. I've listened to folk singers, they're not really folk singers, I've listened to different people from different corners of the tradition. Like Bessie Jones who did these children's singing games, Doc Boggs who played the banjo, Almeida Riddle who did unaccompanied <laughs> singing. And they're my favorite musicians in the same way that Mark Rebo or Miles Davis are my favorite musicians. I just listen to them more for their singing and their interpretation. But eventually I hear some of their songs and a couple of the songs might get, you know, caught in your ear and, and they, because for a certain reason maybe the words speak to you or the melody speaks to you. A lot of track. I can't pick and shovel too. Well, I just had a lot of different ideas of material, and in effect, I cut it, it down. So I had a few bunch of songs, but I had other ideas too. And we went in the studio very open-minded, but then once we got in there, it became very clear which songs felt good to play. And I lay in The previous albums have all, always had elements that are done live, but there's lots of sculpting and adding after, and not lots, but you know, bits here and there. And um, the last one was close to that, but this one was fully that live quality. I don't, I didn't really care about it being live or having a live, it doesn't really even sound like a live album, you know, because there's so much stuff that's happening. Chris is playing electronics live, Bill is playing loops, so they're doing production in the moment. I think what happened is that it wasn't really intended to be like, I mean, the thing about playing live on some level is these musicians who are great improvisers can interact with each other in the moment and you can hear that happening, so that's good. But it's also the case that they were doing so much that it was just like the production was happening in the moment. There was no need for production afterwards. Mm -hmm. 